power and then talk about fishing. Fishing and possibly making a fire. Or not. What I'm doing here is I'm taking a log and I'm wrapping it up in some newspaper. And later, we're going to make a fire. So here's my log. The lights went out, of course. <laughs> and I'm putting the log right here. Right here. Now, what I really want to talk about is not fishing, because fishing, you use nets, or a man uses fishing pole and nets. Light. And in Canada, um, you need fishing rods and things like that. Right? So, you would never use anything, you know, remotely looking as antique and old as doing something off the rail. So, anyway, um, this is a grim handle. It's, it could be possible to use for shoveling snow. We have a lot of that in the winter. Or, it could be used for other things. Go ahead. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I bug this okay. up again? As mom, she's just dumping some water. It's okay. Anyhow, as I was saying, uh, you wouldn't use this for fishing or anything because it's probably like vaguely illegal or something like that. For and also for neighbors, pets, raccoons, squirrels. Other interesting prey that may go on the barbecue really, really well. In another one of my shows, you shouldn't do it. So anyway, here we go. <laughs> we'll try to make the light stand, and we will show you this. This is a pretty little, a little instrument, and as we had see here, this we are not harming any dogs or cats or small critters tonight. Seriously, this is only a log in the newspaper. But I'm going to carefully pick it up and take it to the fire. Like pretty cool, hey? <laughs> so. Later, we'll, we'll talk about barbecues and what we can barbecue with this. 